let's get this party started. It's not my first start. barbecue. Chop that chicken right now. It's a big one. That's a little bit intimidating. You're making it sound terrible. I'm having a moment. Careful what you wish for. I needed that, man. I love it. Lies, lies, lies. The kids are gonna go nuts. Come on, Dad. Think about it. I'm sick of being treated like I'm an idiot. This is where you need to go out and fight. That's yeah. nasty. Oh, for God's sake, shut up. That is a brilliant idea. Have you been paying attention? Just quickly, Abby, I yep. believe congratulations are in order. Ooh. Tough mudder, if you're not familiar with it. He just acted like I was pregnant. Yeah, <laughs> I, was like, I was surprised. That's it all. was, um, for those who don't know, what wow. is tough mudder? Um, tough mudder is when they put all these obstacles um, together and you just, you can know when someone's gone on tough mudder because they will tell you like this. <laughs> um, but it does look like I just rolled on the mud and pretended, but it's hard. And it's go? really you hard. Where'd you come? There's only about It's two... not a race, Ed. It's just... Well, no, there's these actually a race. It's not only about 2,000 people. Where'd you come? Towards back. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we shall move on. Hands on buzzers. Tell me, who are we looking at here? Uh, Ed. I saw this. Kevin Rudd's transitioned. OK. <laughs> Zone, Peter. That's uh, Chelsea Manning, and uh, the way her top is, uh, she looks like she wants us to have a little bit of a wiki peek. <laughs> yeah, I haven't noticed that, but I will pay the points. Thanks, Pete. Some big food news. Chocolate maker Nestle has failed in its attempt to make. Failed in its attempt to make what? Abby. They tried to copyright Kit Kat? You absolutely trademark those distinctive four fingers Love it. in the UK. A photo of Chinese panda Ying Hua went viral this week for doing what? What was the panda doing? <laughs> Sam. I think he bought a one-bedroom cage in Taronga Zoo. <laughs> it's not related to this country. It's just a thing pandas do and it's kind of popular. Ed. It's a panda video, so it's either rolling or falling. It was just a, it was just a photo and all he was, oh, was doing a photo. was... photo? Doing another panda. OK. <laughs> he was using a rocking chair. Apparently that's that's enough to go viral. Oh, it's not just God. what pandas do. Yeah, there you go. All right, let's look at all things entertainment. <laughs> Rebel Wilson has just arrived back in Australia. What for? Biffy. She's suing. She's suing magazines for making up false stories. Absolutely. Biffy, that's I'm weird, isn't it? That, 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 that magazines would make up false stories about a celebrity, isn't it? It is. I'm very interested to see the outcome of that, Ed. How many times yeah. have you been pregnant in the last year, 43 Biffy? in the last 12 months. <laughs> Excellent. You look great, Biffy. <laughs> <laughs> Late night host Conan O'Brien is facing court. What for? Abby. Uh, accused of stealing jokes. Apparently. What celebrity couple is now worth more than one billion dollars? Ed. Is it Ronda and Couture? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> that's enough, Pete. Uh, Beyonce and Jay-Z. Indeed. Followed by Cassie Sainsbury and her boyfriend. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's been a busy week in Sydney. A Hollywood hunk was heating things up a little on Bondi Beach today. Who was the aforementioned Hollywood hunk? Yeah. Surely it's Zac Efron. Yeah, out here for Baywatch. Yeah, I don't even know that. I just guessed. Seriously? Because he was here. I didn't see him on the beach or anything. I I'm just saying. Fifi is everything. pregnant to Zac Efron. I knew it. I knew it. Forty-four time lucky Fifi. Broadcaster John Laws was described this week as an irrelevant, sexist, misogynist idiot. Why? Happy. Because he is. OK. Uh, that's opinion. Uh, but, uh, Sam? No, it was revealed, actually, on your show that um, uh, that he still likes the, the women that work for him to wear short skirts. Or skirts. Still makes women wear the short skirts. Back in the 70s, they had to wear Valvoline, so... Um, <laughs> <laughs> Tell me, who are we looking at here? <laughs> Peter. That is in John Law's studio, actually. <laughs> um, <laughs> <laughs> in interview, Abby. Oh, look, it wasn't my best night. I was wasted, but... <laughs> Those That's Trump's choice to take over the FBI. Okay. <laughs> We're giving it to repeat. Um, it's actually Jennifer Lawrence leaked vision of her at a nightclub. In Austria, apparently. Whoa, just a birthday yeah. party and it came out. MasterChef on Wednesday, Matt laid down a big challenge. More than just putting up a delicious dish as a team, we want you to incorporate one very special ingredient. What was the very special ingredient, Peter? Legal advice for George. Oh. <laughs> 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 in the fortune cookie, you're going to slip it in. Maple Thank syrup. It. Can you believe it? Maple syrup. Mind you, you should see next week's mystery ingredient. There it is. Uh, <laughs> MasterChef is going off. 
<laughs> Another huge week on the living room. Are you always craving an afternoon snack? Put the muffin down. Ah. Tiffany has an alternative just as good. This is better? You won't believe what it is. So it's not a muffin. What is Tiff's alternative, Ed? I'm sure you're watching. Points, come on. Uh, that beautiful young woman who's <laughs> pregnant and, and married uh, <laughs> is her... That own... answer is, is it his balls? <laughs> <laughs> Good answer. What, Ed, what is Tiff's alternative to a muffin? The, the, the filth from this part of the day. Uh, it is, it's alternative, it's a, she's going with a croissant because fatty treats are better than sugary treats. Absolutely Tom Reisner. OK. <laughs> I just want to check something. Did you start, was that question uh, started with another big night in the li on the living room? <laughs> Maybe who did those words, sir? <laughs> Show. Take a look at Arne Doe's brush with fame. I've tried to get that sense of a full life and the wisdom that comes with it, but I'm not sure what he'll think of how I've painted his smile. I hope he likes it. A full life and the wisdom that comes with it. Who was Arne painting? Abby? Ray Martin. Abby takes the point. Who do you reckon's a better artist based on what we've seen from Pete's drawings? <laughs> <laughs> I don't think Pete's brush with fame is coming to 10 yeah. very soon. Oh, we could, we could... Come on. <laughs> Just one more time, I mean, that's... <laughs> that's... That's you painting arm, though. That's great. <laughs> All right, we shall move on. Huge interview on the ABC this week. Can I, can I get you to do the voice for me? Uh, sure. Who is she the voice of? It's Fifi. Peppa Pig. It is indeed. Take a look. Hello, I'm Peppa Pig. Although, I reckon there is a better voice. Oink, oink. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Two members of the Studio 10 audience were taken to hospital after what fell on them? Peter. John O. Coleman? Yes. <laughs> Took out an entire row. No, it wasn't John O. Sam. Uh, Ida Buttrose's hip glass. <laughs> oh, please, <laughs> Sam. It's Fifi. It had to be a light, something to do with... Uh, something that was above them. Yeah, that's kind of how gravity works, <laughs> Fifi. <laughs> But you know what, that is, on a, on a low bar night, checking the scores, yeah, a camera jib, a piece That's of camera jib would pay that, Phoebe. Gosh. New episodes of what cult 90s TV series premiered this week? <laughs> Abby. Twin Peaks. Twin Peaks is back. Oh. Sam, still no word from SPS about the reboot of ADBC? Wonderful. You know, <laughs> that would mean a lot more if anyone knew what ADBC was. <laughs> just, just interested in how it's going. All right. <laughs> Meet Lady Venus Babani Clark. Jesus. What show has she just joined? Ed. Uh, has she joined Twin Peaks? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no, Fifi. The Real Housewives of Melbourne. She's a new, so they kicked someone out? They kicked a couple off. Petty Fleur went, didn't she? Petty Fleur's she? gone. Yeah. Well, she resigned. Resigned, uh, of course. And, and Susie, she left too. So this Lady is Venus is now joining the Real Housewives of and Melbourne I'm, and it's made news all over the country. This is being described as one of the biggest busts. <laughs> I think of that. <laughs> 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 Break up next, our guest quiz master, Nick Warhurst. <laughs>